Hello everybody and welcome back to the Mega Modded series. We are still running our streak, doing just fine. And we are going to have a look. Oh, we're starting as Eden. Okay, I'll always take an Eden. Whenever Eden shows up, I will always take an Eden because we can start with modded items. And he's just, Eden's just fun. We started with, okay, this is going to be strange. So we started with um, a friend and Urn of Souls and the Rotten Penny. Okay, Urn of Souls is, is just... Big amazing. I don't know how to feel about Strawman. One thing I will say about Strawman is I've used him in the past and had great success. And they also did change him recently to actually have the same speed stat as your character. Which previously he didn't. Which was a huge issue with him. And it made him, I wouldn't say useless, but not great. Um, and yeah, this is going to be interesting. I don't know how this is really going to play into Urn of Souls. I, I've got to admit. Do remember that we can give him items. Hey, we actually got um, abundance here, which has been has been tweaked because I was a cry little piss baby and <laughs> got annoyed at how it was implemented before and um, went and told the developer. Uh, but at the same time, I feel like my my whinging and moaning only only serves to better the mod. Or at least I hope it does. I'd, I'd like to think that a developer just wouldn't implement something. Okay, so that one was just breaking my donation machine. Um, that is decidedly pretty bad. But remember, the shops are free. Um, so let's have a look, see. what Do we want to buy Alabaster Box? See, the thing is... I do want it. But I have to pick it up as Keeper Boy. But I'm pretty sure he can't take Soul Hearts. I mean, it is free, so we'll let him have it. Oh, wait, he can't pick up... Okay, it doesn't matter. I mean, like I said, it was free. But he can't, he can't pick up Actives. I did not know that. Telepills. Pretty good Telepills. We got ourselves... Ooh, we got ourselves some good stuff here. So I think Hollow Heart is... Completely the way to go here. We also got brown eye, which uh, I, I I still I don't think this guy can pick that up, can he? Um, one minute. No, he can't. Reflected mother's kiss harms us with double payoff. Uh, we could get an extra heart. I actually think the the hollow heart is better, anyways. Uh, and I'm not going to take the rotten hearts. In fact, wait a minute. Let me just try this. Can I can I take them as you? Yes, I can take them as you to get flies. Ha ha ha. I found a, a baby, tiny little loophole. Okay, good, good. Yeah, Strawman is such a strange item to start with. And honestly, Abundance is an interesting item to start with as well. Um, I think, yeah, it can't teleport you to the error room now. Or at least if it can, it's a very low chance. I don't know if you completely removed that ability or just significantly lowered it. But also, like, the abilities that, that, that can do are, are much different now. Um, you know what? You can have the range upgrade. I don't care. Um, yeah, the, the abilities that it has are much different now. Like, that, that breaking a donation machine is a new one that I believe I suggested. I can't remember for sure. I'm going to go normal path. Um, and um, there's a few other new ones in there as well. Like, I think one of them's like, when you enter, it can reroll your active, which is obviously a pretty negative effect, but also kind of fun. <laughs> I kind of, I, I do like the idea of that one. It's a lot more entertaining. Another telepills. I mean, I'll at least hold on to it. So as you might imagine, with our um, with our keeper friend here, we are require uh, we are going to have to. Ooh, I didn't realize we got to place double bombs. Um, we are going to have to be careful with his health. We can, however. Oh no, no! I was going to say we can use him to enter here. No, we can't. I lied. Yeah, we we're going to have to be careful with him. Um, his health is regained as the normal keepers would be. With um, do you know what? This is a an absolute urn of souls sort of room. This. Uh, his health is going to be refilled with coins, which means he might be a little easier to keep alive. It means he might be a little harder to keep alive. We don't really know. Okay. Double soul heart. He is very, very nice. Of course. Make sure to go to our shop. I really should try and make sure we go to our shop last, though. Make sure it's the last thing we do on every floor. Just in case that chance to teleport does still exist. I don't think it does. But it's it's better to be safe than sorry. In, 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 in that... Um, on that vein, we should go and fight our boss now. Okay, we do have to be careful because Urn of Souls 
has a bit of associated pushback with it, which is causing some issues with uh, our characters getting a bit disjointed. Which is kind of funny, but also kind of a pain. Okay, good. I don't know if this guy can take Devil Deals. I think I'm going to leave the Devil Deal for now. Unfortunately, our um, items haven't been that good. Probably should have given that to the Keeper, to be honest. Uh, Phantom Pains. Experimental. Ooh, Tears Down is pretty rough. Speed Down is even rougher. And that's also pretty rough. Okay, so not great overall. We did get a HP up out of it, but considering we have the Hollow Heart, I really don't think HP ups are very valuable for us. <laughs> the Speed Down is specifically quite, quite a problem. Uh, Phantom Pain's there. As I went through the door, that kind of scared the bejeebus out of me. Right. Just remember, we can plant two bombs. That's super valuable info. Ooh. I don't know if I like the fact that this heart has, um... Has, like, a black outline. I didn't notice that before. It's, it looks a bit... Looks a bit strange looking at it now. Did we get a golden troll bomb? But again, the Phantom Pain's went off at the exact same time as... God damn you, troll. Remember that we don't really need money anymore. Money is specifically going to be used to heal up our friend. I'm going to try and find our secret room. Nope, we don't have one. Okay. Good to know. Good to know. Right, where is our item room? Yeah, it, it would actually be a lot worse with this fire rate down if we didn't have our keeper with us. Having our keeper with us does significantly lower the the risk of that being an issue. All right, so we're going here. Ooh, 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 hell yes! This is a great item. Great item. Very excited to have it. Right, we don't even have a key. Okay, okay. Free shop is uh, no more. Although I'm pretty sure this is the secret room, so we should be fine. Yeah. Excuse me. Teleporting me to other rooms. No, thank you. Yeah, look at that. Ooh, I just it, I just realized as well. It's going to synergize nicely with uh, Ernest Souls there. I didn't even think it would, but it definitely does. It definitely does. Right. Head in here. Not really much for us. Although, we don't need our money for anything anymore, which means playing this guy and then re-rolling is a genuinely good strategy. There you go. And then we can re-roll it. We could get a bunch of luck. I think we roll for roll a bit deeper. I think a lot of luck is very good. Um, spawn an old chest at the start of every floor. Yeah, do you know what? I know that we could roll deeper and get something better, but an old chest at the start of every floor is potentially very strong. Um, ooh, this is a big shop with a lot of stuff. Okay. I don't know what our negative effect was that time, but we still have our active, so I'm happy. Right, so... We grab that. We grab that. We grab that. We grab that. Big old chop here. You can also grab that. Use it once. Get the reversed joker. Teleport Isaac to a black market. Interesting. And we can have a look at another one. Let's check out what this is. Okay, this is some good stuff right here. Right, so first of all, let's uh, grab our Ernest Souls back. Then we're going to teleport to here. And we got Horror Babylon, which I I feel like I have to take on my Keeper Buddy because I'm pretty sure I'll always be active on him. I'm going to try it. It might not have done anything, I'll, I'll be honest. Oh, wait, are we, are we stuck in here? We might very well be stuck in here. Well, that's unfortunate. We're going to have to... Um, yeah, we're going to have to teleport out. Uh, I can't remember the card name. Let me see if I can figure it out. Um, ooh, invalid character. Okay. Um, I think it's spawn 5.30.1, and that's a full card, right? Yes! Here's my brain working bigly. That's a bug, so I'm, I'm, I'm completely fine with, uh, with cheating our way back to the normal floor, because we, we literally would be softlocked and have to end the run there, which I don't think is a great idea. Uh, and then let's go to a black market as well, why not? Right. Oh, okay. We got some interesting stuff here. We got a new chest type. I don't, I don't know what that is. It seems to be some sort of mimic chest. More money is pretty decent for us here. I thought it was going to hurt. Okay, that one only gave us a spider. I don't know exactly what that chest will do normally, but it seems intriguing. 
Right, let's play this guy again. Wait, are we are we yet again stuck? Was there anything on this shop that we actually wanted? I don't think there was, was there? Did I leave anything? Maybe I did. I don't remember. I think it was just our telepills we left. Which in that case, let's just bang all these pills down. There's the tears up. There's the health up. And there's the full health. Okay. The game has repented for its previous sins. Down we go. Wow, what an interesting floor. Abundance been an actually good item for once. My god. Hey, there you go, look. Revives you once, dealing damage to all enemies in the room. Again, I'm going to give this to this dude. <laughs> I've given him a lot of items so far that I probably shouldn't have. Amplifies or changes book activation effects or makes them charge faster. Um, nah, it's fine. We'll, we'll leave both of those. Um, like, Horror Babylon especially, I probably shouldn't have given to him, but it was very unlikely I'd be able to activate it is the, is the problem, really. I just don't see a world in which I'd be able to get my health down to, down to no red hearts, or like half a red heart, really. Okay, this is a hard room. In fact, this is a urn of soul sort of room. God, look at all that fire. Good, good. Okay, I do, I do want to see what happens if I do end up reviving this guy. Will he revive as a normal character? Will he revive as the keeper again? I don't actually know. Get, get that in there. I kind of need to give him a fire rate up as well. He's been, he's been doing well so far. He hasn't been hit yet. I mean, honestly, our health right now is, is kind of absurd. We have so much health. Um, that's just going to get confusing. I mean, I'm going to use it once. Hey. <laughs> Welcome to the crew. Join us. Ow. I keep a buddy got hit there. Annoyingly, we did get a key, but it's across a gap. Okay. Be very careful of the pushback. In fact, just stand against a wall here. It'll be better. Okay, there's a key. Right. Remember to go to our shop last, though. Look down. Eh. Not terrible. This is just such a strange run. Such a strange run. Can I have a penny, please? Just to fill my dude's health back up a little bit. Ow. I got hit that time. Apparently, I cannot. Okay. Do not push me into these spikes, Senorita Dumpy. Really? Neither of those hit? Okay. Oh my god, no. My keeper dude's going down. One more big hit on this boy, and he's going down. I would hate to see it. Like I said, he might revive. I don't know. Okay. Right. I guess we just grab this again. Right, really need some pennies for this boy. Really need some pennies for him very soon. Uh, secret room could also be here. It is indeed. It's it's smelty room. Um, dice bag would be interesting. Chests have a high chance to be eternal. Heal the needy. Red poops no longer regrow. And at the beginning of every new floor... Grant 10% damage, size up, both damage and size up, stay if the trinket is dropped. I feel like I want to, I want to just smelt this. Gimme, gimme, gimme. There you go, smelt it, and then take this. I feel like that's a pretty good way of doing that. That secret room definitely needs to be rarer, by the way. That's from the Epic Act developers. Super cool mechanic. I love the smelt or anything. But yeah, it's, it's very common, and the amount of trinkets you get in that room is frankly quite absurd. Like, even without the smelter, that room would be overpowered. That hurt us when we entered that time. Um, right, we'll grab this, this, and this. The foiled chariot. 
Right, see if I can get some pennies here. Yes, there you go. Heal up, my friend. Heal up. Okay, let's keep it going. Haven't had our active rerolled yet. Free shops are proving to be quite fruitful. Abundance is proving to be a decent item too. Before, it was just in a state where I wouldn't ever, ever picked it up again. At least now I would pick it up again. Right. Let's go. I'm loving this run so far. This is so weird. <laughs> this is such a wacky run. There's our old chest. We don't have a key for it at the moment. Probably don't want to play any of those. I mean, Unicorn's uh, Horde is kind of okay, but obviously our active right now is, like, a lot better. There's our key. Crack that boy. Eh, you can have that. I didn't realize that old chests could give such bad items. <laughs> I thought old chests had, a, like, a unique pool that was actually pretty good, but maybe that's not the case. Shoot the fire. Damn it. Okay, there you go. Shot, you shot it a bit late there. I love this fire item. It's so cool. Ah, oh, I really should be leaving pennies, like, lying around in places just to make sure we have some safety. Just to make sure that we that we know that, that if, uh, if our boy takes a hit, we've got some refresh on him. <laughs> I love the amount of fires this shoots out. It's literally like a proper flamethrower. The blue flame and the real red flame. Okay, now we need another key. We definitely need a fire rate upgrade, just generally, though. Our fire rate's not great right now. Fire rate is not great. Ooh, we got a good old charged battery there. Oh, God. That, that dude hit us both in one fell swoop. Absolute aggression right there. <laughs> just look at that. It's just beautiful. It's just beautiful. Right, take them all out. Come on, key. Where are you? How could we go this long without a key? Okay, this is actually going to be a very hard room with that champion there. Okay, we got him. We got him. Honestly, the triple shot is carrying us so hard right now. Wait a minute, let me... Oh, God. Oh, God. Keeper, you might die here, and I apologize if that ends up being the case. But, honestly, yeah, I gotta say, I don't know how I'm gonna do this without you getting hit. Okay, let's go back and uh, heal him up a little bit, because I feel like we need to. That, that mushroom very much could have killed us then as well. <laughs> also, one second. Let's just check this out. There you go. You see, it was worth it. Oh, there's a Palti in here. No. No. Oh, that was close. <laughs> that was so close. Right. Our boy can finally pick up some coin. I think Wooden Cross actually isn't what I'm going to take here. Yuck. I'll take a Yuck Heart. Why not? What makes you larger? I, I don't really think we need that. Come on. Where is... I need two keys. I need one for my shop and I need one for my item room. So far, we have neither. I mean, I could go and play my machines. My machines could give us um, some stuff. And maybe I will end up doing that. We'll see. We'll play out the rest of the floor. See how it looks. You see that? That was beautiful. Just escaped the worst set situation ever then. I was boxed in. But I was like, hell no. You can't do this to me and my keeper friend. He is my best bud. You will not tarnish our relationship. You see what I mean? <laughs> this is just absurd. Like, I mean, we don't want anything here, but, like, that should not be that common. <laughs> I get that it costs to, um... Oh, God. There's a big issue here. Okay, keep us dead. Keep us going down. Oh, he did revive. He did revive. Thank God. Okay, yeah, we... Oh, and he revived with Horror of Babylon, too. Look at that. I don't know why it activated, but I'm very happy. Okay, yeah, this is uh, a little bit, a little bit boxed. 
Because we have the Spirit Sword, it's going to be pretty tough to not have him die on every uh, Devil Angel deal. Range up Trinket, and we've also got Life Saving, Demon Beggar, Blood Donation Machines, and Confessions. A 50% chance to not take health. Kind of interesting. Um, can I do this, by the way? Does this work? It very much does. Good, good, good. Sad that he can't take trinkets, though. I really wish he could. Right. Back we go. We're gonna need some keys from somewhere. This is, uh... This has been interesting. <laughs> yeah, boss fights are gonna be basically impossible to not lose our keeper buddy on now. Which does mean he's probably dead next floor. Just because we have to use Spirit Sword unless we want to really keep our distance. Oh my god. Calm down, buddies. Calm down. There's a key! Oh my god, we got a key. And we even got one of those two. Which I can't pick up for some reason. I still don't really know what these are or how they work. Apparently they're not soul hearts. What? I don't understand. I'm sure you, loads of you told me in the last episode and I've just missed it. Ah, damn it. We got a greed fight. Why well, get items for free when you could not? Turn the shop into a normal one. Hell yes. Right. Now we can go out of here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Get fucked. Also, this this shop costs money. What on earth is going on here? Why? I can't believe you'd do this to me. A shop that costs money? How dare you? How dare you? Right. We managed to make it work on this floor. We still need another key for our item room. I doubt we'll get it, but I'll try it. I'll try my best. This is such a strange run. It's like playing Jacob and Ezao, but frankly better. <laughs> hmm, okay. Only you can drop keys, really. Did not mean to drop that. And there you go. Keys. Ah, oh, you bastard. Keys. Yes! You beast! Thank you. And we get a lychee boy too! Hell yeah! More friends to join the crew. Let's go. More friends to join the crew. I never really, really even read what that sage item does, I'll be honest. This little follower dude. You know what? Let's uh, drop some of them. Unfortunate. We've got this double bombing thing. It's worth doing. Right. Let's get the hell out of this floor. And see just what happens. I reckon we're going to lose our Keeper Boy pretty darn soon, I've got to admit. But he has, he has put in a valiant effort thus far. A valiant effort. I'm not, I'm not going to open that yet this time. Because I think our item room is potentially more valuable. Uh, what the hell just happened to my health then? Oh, I think my uh, my leech just healed me. Thanks, leechy. Is this an XL floor? Nope, it's just very big rooms. This is a bit scary. Yeah, of course he got hit. Just get some fire in there. Ow. Thank you. Wait. Oh, I thought I thought maybe he could heal up my keeper boy. Doesn't look like he can. Maybe if I took it on him, he could have. I don't know. There's a penny that I can't reach. So sad. Oh god. No. He's going down. Don't don't die on me. No! No! There goes my hero. 
Watch him as he goes. There goes my hero. That's so sad. He was the best of fr <laughs> the best of friends. No one was any match. But now we we can at least efficiently use our flamethrower and not have to worry. Hemolacria, you say? Hemolacria, you say? Oh hell yes! Oh hell yes! This is quite the synergy. I don't know what negative thing happened to us there, but I'll accept it. That's a lot of bombs. I don't even need that many bombs to be honest. No, do you know what? I'm going to take them anyways. It's a lot of bombs. Oh, damn. Edgeless cube baby plus the urn of souls is kind of insane. Or at least it was for a second there. Ah. Oh. I see now. I can just spam the lid on and off to make him fire. That's pretty good. Let's, let's try to test that out in our room, shall we? It's actually not that good. <laughs> no, no, no. It's pretty good. It's pretty good. But yes, uh, Hemolacria plus this fire thing is uh, quite the synergy, as you can see. I like this. All right, finally open this up. Right, uh, mirror shard, chance for bloody piercing, little, um, transductor, charges active item, even if room doesn't contain enemies, tears fired by familiars, okay, let's try out this. I still think this doesn't work, though. Yeah, I'm not seeing it working, I'm, I'm just gonna take this. Fire! We are the Lord of Flames, bow to me! We are the Lord of Flames. Okay. Throw into here. Let's just cute baby this bitch. There you go. This is how you beat a room. <laughs> I love the fact that that actually works. That's so many pills. Holy hell. Look at this. Stand still. Oh, that one actually got me. Okay. I'll give you that one. <laughs> That's such a dumb way to complete a room. Something's wrong. Yuck. Experimental. Health up. Got a lot of uh, red health. More phantom pains. Shot speed up. I like that. Right, let's keep going. Oh, what the hell hit me then? I do not know. Another health up. Hey, we got two tinted uh, spike rocks here. I want to see how these work. That one gave me a red cracked key. Holy hell. And so did that one. These are fucking strong. These are strong. These are very strong. <laughs> they, they better be rare. Considering I've had two in one room, I'm going to imagine that they're not super rare. D20. Um, Not really what we're looking for. Got to admit, not really what we're looking for. Cracked key. Um, Okay. I used my cracked key here. It opened a room on the minimap. Can't enter it. <laughs> Thanks, game. Very cool. Right, let's keep pushing forward. This has been a roller coaster of emotions this episode. Absolute roller coaster. There's so much going on. I'm loving this. The fire is just great. And now we have Big Sword too, apparently. I'm not sure why our sword's so massive, but I will accept. 
Also, I should probably check Devil Deal at this point. Do I want to sacrifice my only children? I'm sorry, Leech Buddy, but yes, yes, I do. Oh, great. That was so worth it. That upsets me. I lost my Leech Buddy. For shade. There has never been a larger injustice than this right here. I did, however, get stompy for some reason. Ordinary life. Nice. Oh my god. <laughs> just there's so much fire. Oh wait, there was another item there? Okay. To be fair, I'm pretty happy with this item, I'll be honest. Um, spawns an old chest. Using a card has a small chance of spawning an eternal heart. Probably would want to take that. We do lose some damage with this, though. Both damage and size upstairs if you drop the trinket. Well, that's just a complete lie, because I lose the damage when I drop the trinket. <laughs> lie, game. Lie. It's okay. I forgive you, game. I am the Lord of Fire. I forgive all sins. So many trinkets, my god. <laughs> it's just crazy. The Lord of Fire forgives you. I just love how large I am as well. Okay, I actually have Stompy as well. I do indeed actually have Stompy. Fool card. Oh my god, careful. The fire's good, but it doesn't it doesn't cleanse all. Oh look a buddy, a friend. We could get a whole ass friend. That's a green brain right there. Ow. I think we lost a burn heart there, maybe? I don't know, I'm getting confused. Teleports you to a chest room outside of the map. Don't know how to feel about that. Do I get to come back to the map? I guess I'll clear the floor and find out after. God damn. Ooh, this could be a, a bit of a tricky room here, but don't matter. I'm an absolute god. Oh god, no, this could be a tricky room. <laughs> The AoE of this Hemolacria is absurd, and I love it in every way. Never nerf this. This synergy is my precious. <laughs> it just covers the entire room. What could be better than this? Just guys being dudes. Well, what the hell's this? A black heart that gave me a damage up? All righty then. There are some interesting new additions to this game. Some of which I feel are a bit overpowered. Or a bit too strong. But that's not that's not always a bad thing. As long as they're rare. Oh, we got Dry Baby? Hello. My driest of friends. My driest of friends. We got plus one charge for your activate. Okay, that doesn't matter. We'll try reroll. Red Stew, however, pretty good. Although it does cost us money. But that's a good downside, the fact that rerolling actually makes them cost things. That's a good downside. Right, let's go back and get that air. Uh... Oh, we might get hit here. Oh, nope, we're skilled. Let's go back and get these cards and see how these work. Another health up. And then another one. Okay, that's that's a cool that's a cool card. Imagine who just gave me another one now. Hero font would probably just keep that. Judgment. Ooh, we can recycle this card a little bit here and see what we get. 
We got an Abyss card. Do you know what? Cycle it again. Give me the D-Infinity. Do you know what? Hell yeah, we'll rock the D-Infinity for a bit. Why not? Why not? Got the Luck Foot here. I don't know. Do I, do I want to rock it or do I want to be the God of Flames? I like being the God of Flames, I'll admit. No, do you know what? I like being the God of Flames too much. I'm sorry, D-Infinity. The God of Fire shows no mercy. He bows to no man. <clears throat> and we'll be on our way, thank you. I mean, if we put our thingy urn away here, if we actually can't put our urn away, so that's a problem. I don't know what I did, but I can no longer put the urn away. Okay, there you go. We're back to normal. We are looking rather thick. Ra a rather thick boy. We are we are big. <clears throat> Another few soul hearts there. That's, that's good reserve, I suppose. God damn. The fire god is is thick with rage. Okay, just keep moving. Just keep going. Just remember we got Stompy as well. We can walk right through a lot of things. Try and keep the speed up though. So we got our red stew damage keeping keeping us fresh. Ignore all the facts, all the danger and the fact that we uh, are larger than life. It's not relevant. Oh my god. That's a red poop there. Be careful. Oh, it's just glorious. It just is. Not only does the Hemolacra itself just do great damage, but it just literally douses the entire room in thousands of fires. <laughs> and there's not much we can be do to be stopped. Tell you what will stop us. Someone making Skolex into a normal enemy. Please no. <laughs> Who had this idea? Oh my god. That's a big sword. <laughs> Holy hell. We just got even larger. No way. We got a reflected. Beautiful. Beautiful. Sadly, nothing great, though. <laughs> there is another machine in this room. We just can't see it because we're so gargantuanly large. Good, good. I, I literally, I can't see basically anything. It's it's hilarious. But our spirit sword just keeps getting bigger, so... Kind of works, I guess. Oh my god. I am the fire starter. Twisted fire starter. Oh my god. I keep saying it, but I just I just can't believe how crazy this is. This is a two-item combo that is just glorious. It's just so cool. And it's actually producing very little lag. It looks like it should be a very laggy synergy. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, you fool. You fool. You thought you could step to me? Also, new Krampus fight. Lump of coal on this bad boy. Oh, hell yes. Oh, hell yes. Right, up we go. Size up again. This trinket is, uh, it's pretty crazy. This trinket's got some, uh, it's got some strange interactions. <laughs> some strange properties, so to say. Lumber Coal is so good with this setup. <laughs> oh my god. Right, where are we going now? None of this way, apparently. This was completely the wrong way. It's always weird when a large rim is the wrong way. I, I don't know how I'm getting hit so little. I quite literally cannot dodge if I fucking tried. 
It is very difficult. To be fair, I do have the same size hitbox as regular Isaac. I'm only visually this large. So that, that does help. But still, wait, where am I meant to be going right now? I feel like I've been everywhere. Two, one. Did I did I miss a door through here? I missed a door somewhere, but I don't know where. Up here? Nope. I, so I've got to have missed a door over here then. Wait. That door wasn't there before. What the heck? <laughs> This is confusing. This is majorly confusing. Fire rate's great. I don't think Magic 8 Ball's gonna cut it. That could be good. We'll try that out. Sadly, it didn't go with any uh, transformations. So where the liberty fuck am I? Oh, there's a door here. Okay. Die, fiends! By my fiery hands! Look at these dodges. No one can stop these dodges. Oh my god. Now that was just guaranteed damage, wasn't it? Apparently me uh, walking into that room opened the door as well, which is rather nice for us. Oh god, it was the wrong way though. It was the wrong way! No. Wait, what? I'm very confused. How is it still the wrong way? Okay, right. Ah, oh, okay, there's this way. I see, I see. Life confuses me. Oh my god. I can't see any of the rocks and things in the way. That's a possessed boy right there. We got him. Was there an enemy there? We'll never know. <laughs> oh god, this is a, a weird room for these enemies. Come back here, you. You throw fire at me, I throw fire straight back. How are you not dead yet? Okay, there you go. What the hell hit me then? Who knows? We'll never know. Is, is the is the okay? There is another dumpy in this room. I was like, there's one at one side. Is the one at this side as well? It's underneath me, so I can't tell. God damn. The good thing is the boss is gonna get wrecked. We we have got great HP as well, which is nice. Ow. Where the hell is the boss though? Come on. I don't care. Just let me through. Okay, that one's a champion. Get him. Get him. Soul of Jacob and Ezo. I want to use that, but I, I just know it'll crash the game. What's going on right now? Literally, who knows? Tooth and nail is going to be interesting here. Ten. Boop, boop, boom. Oh, fucking look at that. What on earth is Isaac meant to do? <laughs> oh my god. Too bad we don't get the spirit sword in every room. We got some bad stuff here. We did, however, get mutant fetus, which is pretty interesting. But the rest of this isn't great. Tooth and nail needs to be basically be our savior here. Literally no idea what I'm looking at here. There was an enemy under me. Okay, good. We need more chests, more items, please. I did manage to sneeze on that guy somehow. 
Give him the Brimstone's Curse. I don't quite know how. I really don't know how. I like the way when we plant a bomb, we can't even see it. It's that small. Like, look at that. <laughs> Get like, move out the way to be able to know where it is. We are killing stuff remarkably fast. That is one big plus of, the, of all this. And the, the mutant bomb thing is a very good item too. When we hit an enemy, tears have a chance to spawn a bomb on said enemy. Very useful. I don't even know where you are, Stan. Just stop. Okay, good. More chests, please. I suppose we've got very low luck. Not going to be as many here. I don't think I've ever reached this size and the run still be playable. Look at that. With Brimstone Curse, like the whole room somehow. Oh my god. Some enemies you just cannot avoid taking damage. This is still one of the most enjoyable runs I've had in a, in a while, though. And I've been having a lot of enjoyable runs recently, so that's that says something. That says a lot, actually. I, I th These enemies are just like... Who knows how to dodge these guys? Who even knows? Like, I, I cannot dodge these, these uh, attacks actively. The thing is, I know that if we make it to the boss, we're going to be fine. I just, I'm not confident we're going to make it to the boss. We need, like, a good amount of red health drops before we get there. <laughs> no thank you, sir. The fire does a good amount of damage, to be honest. As is. Okay, I did get a, a red heart there. That is something. <laughs> Not the best, but it's something. I, I, I just don't know what I'm fighting. Is that a lust in the room? I, I, yeah, it is. I actually managed to get lust there. I don't know how. No thank you with that bomb. I actually sneezed one of the bombs that he threw at me away. <laughs> I was quite lucky. Oh, there's a brownie in here. <laughs> I was like, oh, it's just blast assist in the middle of the room. Nope, nope, nope. It's a brownie. Did not see you in here, fella. Got that red heart. Good. Traveling upwards is terrifying because I, I literally have no idea what I'm entering. Ow. No, you hit me again. Please give me a heart after this. We just gotta go for it, I think. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> Void? Oh, you've gotta be kidding me. Um. <laughs> I gotta. I know I'm on a streak, but boy, I can't give it up. You might say, baby, give it up, but this baby ain't giving it up. My size has reached critical mass. I have no idea what's happening anywhere. We are hoping for a just gargantuan amount of HP drops. Ow. There are so many enemies in this room. What the hell? <laughs> Hopefully these champions give me a good amount of drops too. I don't even know if the void champions drop stuff. I'll be honest. It doesn't seem like they do. What's in the middle of the room? I don't know. Oh, it's a Gigabomb boy. I can barely even see the bomb. <laughs> Calm down, fella.
Really? You're gonna give me a brown chest with a brown chest? Okay, there's a half red heart in there. I can see your value. Don't know what I'm fighting. <gasps> That's a lot of HP for me. The world. Hell yes. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> right, let's head on back down to where all those bosses are. Let's go. Yeah, this is just absolutely hope and prayer territory right now. We're relying on basic instinct and that is it. Also, champion enemies plus tainted enemies. I don't think tainted enemies can be champions, which is a very good thing. <laughs> okay. You should go down relatively quickly. Good, good. Good, good. Ah, there was a fire there. God damn it. Wheel of Fortune. Could give us HP. Or just an absurd amount of money. Wow. Wasn't expecting anywhere near that amount. I can barely place bombs properly. No thank you, spiders. No thank you. Okay, we can skip a few rooms by doing this. Oh my god, I love it on the basic enemies. Keys. I think we're okay for them, thank you. Right, first boss. Thank god we get the sword and all the boss fights. I didn't think we would, but we do. But bombs isn't really going to cut it for us, but I'll accept. Prop Tursis. I don't even know how this is going to work. Probably not very good with the sword, I'll admit. Oh, actually, no. No, no, no. If we get close, it's very, very good with the sword. I mean, I'll admit, getting close is not exactly easy. But, holy hell, we did it. <laughs> the wind streak stays alive. The wind streak stays alive. Beautiful. The largest, most flame-prone flame boy you've ever seen. Hope you guys enjoyed that crazy one. I'll see you guys in the next one.